Hey Taurus, thank you for tuning in with me for your weekly message. As you can see, I'm recording this October 23rd, but this is for the week of October 28th. Okay, so let's get into it. Taurus, let's see what's going on for you. Show us a message for Taurus. Let's get the present energy. Taurus, present energy. Spirit, please show us. Taurus, present energy. Okay, the emperor. So your present energy, you could be dealing with a father figure. Um, you could just be in this emperor energy. You could be the masculine energy here, uh, whether you male or female, but you could just be in your boss-like energy, okay? You're standing on whatever the heck you're standing on. Um, you're in this leadership role. Uh, but for some of you, you could be just being a father or you dealing with the father figure, whether it's a child's father or your actual, your, your birth father, okay? Or a father figure. It don't necessarily have to be your birth father. Let's get the desires. Um, I'm going to see more on that emperor, though. Let's get the desires for Taurus. Your desire in the moon and the five of wands in reverse. Okay. You're secretly desiring to just release all competition, like all um, combative energy or any type of um, argument, disagreement. You, you're secretly desiring to just let that go. Um. Maybe you're just tired of arguing. You're just tired of fighting. You try, you, you're tired of going tit for tat. But you're keeping this a secret. Like you're not really expressing this. It's not being expressed at the at the moment. That's what this is. But you're desiring this. So, but you haven't expressed it yet. And this could be whoever this is pertaining to. We have Leo, Pisces, the energy here. Could be Cancer. Um, mentioned Aries, I believe, with the emperor, I said. All right, and then um, let's get what's helpful for Taurus at this time. What's helpful for you is just to be still. What's helpful for you is not to make any moves at this time. That What's helpful for you is to be still and gain a different perspective about this whole situation. Try not to take any action right now or during this, you know, during this time this week. Um... Show us more. Let's get uh Taurus obstacles. What is Taurus obstacles at this time pertaining to this message? Your obstacles is taking action. It could be kind of like, you know, you're wavering, taking action or waiting. Like, yeah, you're delaying the process because you don't know for sure if now is a good time or if you should wait. I feel like you should wait, especially with what, what's coming out in your helpful energy. Show us more on this challenge, Eight of Wands. The way it came out, it didn't come out upright or reverse. It came out sideways. And I like to mostly take the cards as is, unless Spirit give me other reasons. Um, yes, I just feel like, yeah, you're wavering. That's everything I just mentioned due to um, taking action. Uh, this action could be you taking forward movement, actually physically going towards this person, or you just picking up the phone and voicing yourself. So it's different for everyone due to your situation. It just seemed like someone is definitely like back and forth with this decision. Should I, should not? Well, right now, no. Near future? What's in a near future pertaining to this message for Taurus? Near future? There could be, it's definitely a transformation that's coming through. So something is changing. We have the death. So there's an ending, a change. But let's get more on... Um, this energy for Taurus. Near future for Taurus. Near future. The near future page of Pentacles. So in the near future, it will be a good time. It will be, the time will come when it's time to, um, to reveal how you feel. To say, you know, it's a time and place for everything. And that is very, very true. Um, sometimes, you know, we may feel like how we feel at the moment, but that present time might not be the time to express that. Um, so, you know, for whatever reason, you know, maybe you won't be heard. You won't be heard at that time. Uh, you could say it as loud as you want or as clear as you want, but it may not be received 
from the other being. It may not be received from the other person. So it could be that, you know, whatever they got going on and not trying to hear what you have to say. So the timing could just be off due to that. Um, yeah, because it's all about receiving, like the other the other end receiving. So in the near future, it looked like your offer will be received at that time or it will be a good time to present it. Let me get more on the near future. Page of Pentacles for Taurus. Yes, I told you. Because it's like, it's this will be a perfect time to give and receive, okay? So prior, if you did it on your own terms, it wouldn't have been received. It wouldn't have been reciprocated. Mm -mm. This person wouldn't have received it. They would have just, like I said, just either ignored what you said or just not hearing it because their mind is on something else or they just don't want to hear what you got to say. Whatever it is, you know, um, that's just like if someone coming to you and if your your mind is focused on something else, you don't want to hear it right now. You're not going to receive it. So it happens with others too. So um, they're basically saying in their future, this will all be balanced out between you and someone. This could be a younger person. This could be a sibling. This could be um, a child. You know, uh, a father could play a part in this situation. Let me get more. Or, you know, the child's father, however this is, show us more on this emperor. Clarify the emperor for Taurus. Clarify this emperor. Someone could have a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn child or sibling. Um, hmm. Show us more on this emperor. All right, Taurus. So this emperor energy, this could be a father figure, right? Whether this is your actual father or this is someone that you're dealing with um, or was, you could have had a child with this person or whatever. Or you could be the masculine, the the emperor, the, the male, the father energy here. I don't know. I'm picking up some type of jealousy here and um, a control. Like someone likes to have the upper hand here. Um. That could be why a situation was not going to be received at the time that you wanted them to receive it. Um, I'm also getting like, Taurus, you healed or you overcame something. And this father figure, this is kind of suck if this is your actual father, but someone could have been kind of, you know, childish or just uh, speaking about you or not i'm not even gonna say in a negative way i feel like this was more to self like they could have they could have had some type of it's like I'm, I'm picking up a jealousy due to your healing due to you overcoming something like but the jealousy is not like it's more like this is their own inner child issues that they have to fix so this jealousy is stemming from that it's stemming from you know they haven't fully healed and them um, unconsciously being aware of their jealousy of others healing. Like, because they never, they haven't healed from something. So it's like seeing you and having others speak on this. Like, and maybe others is like, yeah, you know, Taurus, they're doing well, or they... You know, they overcame that situation, blah, 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 whatever, whatever. Or, you know, you a changed person. You're more uh, you're more uplifted. You're more light. You're more vibrant. You're more positive. You know, you have this healing energy within you. I don't know. This person, though, may have been, they, they don't like that. It's like they have a temper. Whoever this is may have a temper or anger issue or they get upset really easily or they may yell a lot or just get really aggressive when it comes to when they want how when they want to express what they want. Like I'm getting like when it's time for them to talk, everybody better, better be quiet. <laughs> like I mean, this is a father, but still, you know, it's not that's not right. Whether it's a father or not, a mother or not, you know. 
respect goes both ways, regardless of the age, you know. Um, I mean, of course, you always respect your elders, but at the same time, the elders must respect the children, too. You know, I respect my children. My children is young and I respect them and they respect me and it go both ways. But that's just how, um, you know, I view things. But this person may not view it that way. It's like when I say what I say is when I say it and when and I mean it like I don't know. It's just giving me that vibe. But um, I'm also getting like. If this is like a child's father, um, they feel like they have the right of way when it comes to a decision or, you know, due to a child or, or they, they get upset because they feel like they should have that authority. They feel like they should be in that power to dictate how something should go and it angers them. And it, it, it upset them too, because others may be um speaking of you in a positive form positive light i don't like this jealousy coming from this emperor energy show me more on the king of wands in reverse some of you it could be a fire sign aries leo sagittarius show us more on this king of wands in reverse three of swords like i said they need to heal they need to heal this is why this is where this jealousy is stemming from I'm not, I don't get that it's just because of you. They're jealous of you. No, they're jealous of the energy that you, you, that you have that, that's surrounding you. They're jealous of the, you know, the vibrancy. Like, I feel like this person just haven't encountered that within self and they're still trying to, but they're, they put on this macho image. Like, I got it. You know, I'm the leader. I'm in control. But to be honest, they when they're with their self or when they think about who they are deep down, it's like there's a, a, a sense of um a sense of insecurity. So the image could be put on that way because, you know, they are insecure, so they try to cover that. But they're really heartbroken inside. So this could be your father. Your father, your child's father, someone need healing. And it's going to be a group effort because this person, <laughs> I'm getting like one person can't tie this person down. A lot of people going to have to be like, look, come on now. <laughs> but, you know, of course, that always have to start with self. You, you have to want to heal. And no matter how many people tell you, you have to want it. So, uh. I feel like it's a, it's a slow move. There could be healing between you and this person. It's slow action, but it's definitely going to recover. Because we have the Six of Swords and the Knight of Pentacles. This is definitely moving to peace and common waters with the Six of Swords. But it's slow. Because someone is very cautious, I feel like, because they have not done the work. So they're cautious on how this connection or how this is going to work out. between. This could be co-parenting. This could be... um. This could be you feeling this way, you know. Uh, this is also giving me why in your desires. You're secretly wanting to come out of the conflict. You're secretly thinking you, you're to yourself, you know, um, I just want to release this. Because you're on a healing journey. This is you healing. And people are recognizing this. Friends, you know, family or whatnot. They're seeing the change in you. Um. So it do look like your whole message is mainly about a masculine energy, father figure, um, however this is to you in your world, whoever this male is. It could be a father. It could be you. Um, it could be uh, a brother. It could be an uncle, a grandfather, whoever, a cousin, your, your baby father, or like I say, you as the father. The masculine energy is showing healing is needed okay so if i'm speaking to you taurus that's all you just need to work on self we all experience that once upon a time in our life you know healing is not is never ending so that's going to be continuing for the rest of our life you're going to continue to heal from a lot you know it's a lot of changes a lot of things that we go through in life it don't stop so it may you may heal from one thing but then 
heal from the next. And then heal from the next. And then tomorrow it may be something else that come about that you have to heal from again. So, you know, but whoever this is, um, I don't know. I just feel like they're broken. And they're trying, they're not wanting to, I'm not going to say not wanting to, because I feel like this masculine is wanting to. They're wanting to come to peace with self. But the how is what's the issue. Like this person could be trying to figure out, okay, well, how? And they're seeing how how you healed and like that jealousy is not, like I said, based on the person. Like say, for instance, okay, Taurus, if I'm speaking to you as a male and you know you got to still work on your inner self, you work, have to work on your childhood trauma, you have to work on certain things with self and someone else is really healed. And it's not that you're jealous of them. It's the energy. It's just, it's hard to explain. But yes, it's like you're, you're, the jealousy is not, and it's, it's unconsciously. It's not like, um, yeah, that's just what it is. You know, cause I know a lot of people take, oh, I'm not jealous of nobody. I'm not, but jealousy is a true trait. I mean, that's something that, you know, that's a trait that people have to work on. You know, we have good, we have bad. Everything can't be good. Because then where, how can we balance it out? We got to have good versus bad, right? But once you recognize that, work on it. And that the reason why is there is because of that inner work. And also someone could have a temper or, you know, get upset very easily. That could be the issue here as well. But it do look like there's a change in a connection, however this connection is for you, Taurus. <clears throat> Spirit, please show us a message. But the time will come in the near future um, when things get really balanced out between you and this person. It could be possibly within the next six months. Um, yeah, it could be within the next six months. You know, it's progress, though. Progress. You know, it's not going to be like, dang, six months. But no, it may get a little better tomorrow, a little better next week, a little bit, you know. So it's it's, it's, it's going to take time. Show us a message for Taurus. <laughs> karmic. <laughs> this could be a karmic, you know, a karmic connection. But you, you know, if you have to deal with this person, because we can't have karmic parents. We can have karmic children. We can have karmic um, partners like however friendships you can have a karmic co-worker but yeah we have not today not dealing hurt avoiding a conversation call person boundary still angry so yeah someone kind of like shut down and don't communicate um because they're hurt or whatever but that that's that's gonna open up even if you like i don't care if they don't never talk to me well guess what you all you will because from this message, and if you're still here this long, this is a message for you. Um, someone could be very narcissistic, too. Um, someone may feel like someone just charmed them and used them. And, um, but someone do need to set boundaries, though. I will say that. Um, you know, after this connection is balanced out, set boundaries. It's not like, okay, everything is also so perfect. Now that you got an understanding of this person, this person got an understanding of you, you know, set them boundaries. Um, yeah, someone could be very codependent. Uh, someone could just fear, someone could fear abandonment issues. That's why I said someone needs to do the inner healing. Talking, um, interested, conversing more. Awaited message, arrives, text, call, email, who are in. Exactly. So there will be communication in the future. Be lighthearted. Finding out things coming to light, adapt, and change heart. I mean, wait, I read that wrong. Um, adapt, change, and heal. Yes, that's all this message is about. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, I will extend this in Patreon. Uh, find out your fears more, get more in depth with that. Um, how this person is viewing you is showing how they're being viewed, or you know, this could be you. Take it however it resonates for you. Um, how this person view you, how you view them. Your wish out of this situation, will that wish be granted? Will it come true? And the outcome, 
as well as an oracle message. All right, but that's all I have. I hope you all enjoyed. Until next time, many blessings.